Now that Starfield is launched, Bethesda has decided to give us some news about the next major update to Fallout 76. About a week ago, at the Tokyo Game Showcase, Bethesda released some big news as it pertains to Fallout 76 and the next big update. This may have flown under the radar as most of the news focus has been on the recent release of Starfield, but there is some really good information here. Greetings to everyone at TGS. With Fallout 76, we've explored Appalachia. We return to the fan favorite city of Pittsburgh and soon we'll be showing our cards with an all new location, Atlantic City. Since we announced Atlantic City at the Xbox Showcase last June, we've upped the ante with so much great content that we're splitting it into two releases. Today I'm excited to share that the first update of Atlantic City will be available on December 5th. Atlantic City says stack the deck with new content including new locations, new factions, new creatures, new missions, and new rewards. Plus, a flesh casino where our Wastelanders can test their luck. You won't have to wait until December to roll the dice in Atlantic City. We're inviting anyone who already owns the game on Steam to help test Atlantic City on our public testing server starting October 3rd. Stay tuned in to our social channels and fallout.com for more details. And may luck be with you in Atlantic City later this year. Answer the call of Vault 76. So the Atlantic City update is going to be split into two separate releases. While we don't know exactly what this means just yet, it does mean that we have something to look forward to in 76. The first part of this update will release on December 5th. However, if you are on PC, you can join the public test server starting on October 3rd to playtest the first part of the Atlantic City update. I will be playtesting just so I can get an idea of what is going on and how this update will work. My hope is that it is not like the pit. Don't get me wrong, I did like the pit update, but it was not what I and many others were hoping it would be. Bethesda also plans to release a series of developer deep dives over the course of the first week of October, and depending on my schedule, I will be covering these in either one or a couple videos. There is more to this update than just the Atlantic City part, but we have no details as to what that is just yet, so we shall see when the information is released on October 3rd. For now, I will remain optimistic. Moving to what is currently going on in 76, there is going to be a Haunted Shelter competition, which is fitting since we are going into October. This competition will run from October 2nd to the 27th. To take part in this competition, all you have to do is head over to the Bethesda Discord and submit photos of your camp or shelter. Ten finalists will be selected after the 27th to be voted on by the 76 dev team. First place will win 7,600 atoms. Second and third place will win 5,000 atoms. Fourth and fifth place will get 2,000 atoms. The winners will be announced on October 31st. Bethesda would also like to hear from you. They want you to submit a 500 word or less story about your favorite memories in the wasteland of 76. If this is something you would like to do, just head over to the Bethesda Discord. For now, this is all we know and I will be covering the update details as soon as I have more information to share. Since this next week will give us more information, I will be producing a video or two depending on how much information we get, so stay tuned. Let me know what you are hoping this update will have in the comments below. While you're at it, like, subscribe, and share. And as always, I'm just glad you stopped by. And I'll see you in the next one.